Welcome back to Select Your Friend of TV Circunus, everyone. This time... Hey, dudes. This time around, we go to... All set to go to Mesa City! Mesa City, Utah, USA, whatever. It had been a while since I'd been back in the U.S. Next up... The Notorious Mugshot. Ruthless muscle of the fiendish thigh. What he lacked in brains, he definitely made up for in brawn. Turns out he wasn't always that way. He grew up as the run of the litter. A neighborhood weakling. The only friends he could turn to were usually found on the big screen. It was there that he spotted his first gangster, and he knew instantly that that's what he wanted to be. He spent the rest of his youth working real hard to get there, fueled on his dreams of great power and respect. With enough perspiration, he realized that dream. He'd become a hard-boiled, street-brawling, tough-as-nails gangster, ensuring that he'd never be kicked on or pushed around again. So he's holed up in Mesa City, huh? I've always wanted to go to that thriving American boom town. Sly Cooper in Sunset Snake Eyes. Snake Eyes. Oh, yeah. This style is the best. Sunset Snake I can't wait for the inevitable Mad Max crossover. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, they're releasing a new Mad Max game. But anyway, um, so yeah, welcome to uh, Rocky Mountain. No, I Mountains. meant Sam and Max, not Mad Max. Yeah. Hey, Sly, I thought you said Mesa City was going to be loud and busy. This looks more like a ghost town. Something's happened. Where is everyone? I don't know, but it's starting to give me the creeps. What do you say we take off? And miss all the fun? Besides, I want to try out that new move I got from Raleigh's section of the Thievius Raccoonus. You mean the Ninja Spire Jump? Yeah. Do me a favor and read me the instructions again. To landeth safely upon diminutive points, leapeth lively and presseth the triggering device with the round geometrical object emblazoned upon it. So jump and hit the circle button to land on narrow spots. That's a rough translation. From my uh, in-depth knowledge of uh, the Japanese language, I know that all Japanese wrote in uh, for ye old English. <laughs> and also knew about PlayStation buttons. Indeed. Well, you, ju you just, but... Well, I don't want to spoil it, please. Oh god, this is I going to be great. No, well, actually, it won't like, actually appear until like the fourth game, but that's for reasons that will come apparent there. Ah. Sadly. Alright, fair enough. But yeah, so yeah, dogs. The main oh, one thing I should do. It's a vicious, well, bloodthirsty, murderous dog. Yeah, he thinks he's, he thinks we were bone. Which I can see that, I guess. Slice a bit bony, if you know what I mean. Oh! Pawns everywhere in this video! That was also not bad, not a good joke. No, I know, I don't. Also, get, uh, really further advice punks. returning from uh, my advice regarding Spectre Carmenita Fox. Don't Google Sly Cooper Bone. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> the best darn eggs. Uh, but yeah, I like. I love you. I like eggs. Eggs are pretty cool. But yeah, actually, one thing I do like about the game, like this game in general, and all. Oops. Dog, dogs also have a pretty good, good uh, kill animation. Good job. Yeah. So we actually started all the way over here, but it's. They, I'll basically show you what happens if you try to speed run a level now. But, but yeah, one well, thing I do like about the game. Your bottles. Yeah. So you can skip a uh, club dog. Yeah, that is definitely good. But uh, as I said, as I said again, I guess. One thing I do love about this game is that all the, well, actually about all these like of games, is that all the enemies in the, like the area, are tied to, like all the enemies in the area have always have a theme. Like in Raleigh's level, we saw that everyone had like, uh, was like water, Waters, like, yeah, yeah, water animals or whatever. Also, you could clearly see there was an animal in there. 
But yeah, like water animals, fire, water animals, and roller stuff. And here we have all dogs, because Mugshot is a dog. Wow, cool. Yeah. So he's slowly all over the theme. Again, oh. uh, reminds me of uh, Spyro in a sense. Which, where each level had its own um, two or three kinds of enemies. Nice touch. Yeah, that's actually true. I didn't mention it. And it makes more sense than having uh, the same kind of enemy everywhere. Mm -hmm. Even if it's the same mechanically, just having a different model or uh, even a reskin, it can do wonders for it, I think. Yeah, that's true. But, but yeah, like all the enemies here are. Or in a sense, unique. Like, they all have, of like, course we see any, the obvious yeah, like, religious symbolism in the game. <laughs> yeah. So here we have the most ineffectual... Uh, the most ineffectual light of all time. Hmm, I wonder, should I go through one side? Yes, no, but like, yes. No, but like, the best part it's is when it's not even the appearing, disappearing laser thing, it's just on one side. No, like, and the best part is when you start flashing, you can't really go on that side where the light is on. Also, this dude. Look at this dude. He throws a card at you? He does not even care, and yes, he throws cards at you. He throws ace. How very original. He throws uh, M's of spades. Because aces weren't enough in Mugshot Land. I mean, Mesa City. Oh, I know. Were you supposed to do that? Yeah, so you can get the bottle. A bit, it seemed a bit weird. Well, maybe maybe we were supposed to jump over the uh, truck or whatever. Who cares? Also, guess what has this a hitbox? This is much more effective. Yeah, guess what? Apparently, the hat has a hitbox. I did Wait, not. You... Wow. Okay, that was a weird hitbox. Yeah, because like, I am the first to berate right. somebody for being bad at video games, but that was a weird hitbox. No doubt about it. Yeah. That. Indeed. But if you just like they had well, I guess it's it fits that they had had as a hitbox for a reason that we'll see in like in very on soon. One hand, it very can soon be actually. Justified in a sense, jokingly obviously, in in that well uh, well what's his name is cheating. What? Who? You know, the hitbox. He's oh. breaking the fourth wall like that, cheating. <laughs> yeah, maybe. I guess. There's a fire here that goes to the vault, but we don't have all the vaults yet, so who cares. We'll go here soon, I don't Can you break those walls on your own, obviously, right? Without the... Yeah, okay. Without needing yeah. the... Uh, the gangster dogs to come in first. Yeah, you can. But, no, they do it anyway, so... Makes sense. Yeah. Punch the star here. I mean, even, uh, like, even these, American even... people, uh, we will need your help here. Is this what your average American uh, town or city looks like, right? <laughs> yeah, Trailers precisely. and lasers and shit? Yeah. I never been to America, so I don't know. I know yeah, like, I like Well, you know. Maybe this is Yuka. This, this could be like just Yuka stuff. I guess. Yes. It you know could those, be that. You know, you know those weird people over in Yuka? Uh. Excuse, no, I don't. Excuse because to I've all. never been to Yuta. Yes, yeah, hey, hey, I'm sorry. I'm excuses to all people who live in Yuka, I guess. Unless you are a weird person who lives in Yuta, then uh, we'll get nothing. <laughs> yeah. Let's get weird, people. <laughs> so we have our third ninth bottle, and oh my god, where's the last bottle? How? Oh, man, that sounds like like such a dick move. It's a bit of a dick move, but it doesn't really matter, considering that you know you have to go back to get to the vault anyway. So. Oh. So it's on, so you can literally see it when you go back. Also, that platform oh. down there, I believe oh, well. you can actually land on that platform, but. Nothing will ever. No, you can't like get out of it. A little bit of higher mathematics and voila! Dial in three one. It's funny because that's a number of p or pi or however it's in America in English. I think it's pi actually. In Greek, it's always p, so I always get confused. Yeah. 
I think it, we also say Team Swedish over there. Whoa, 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 explosive hats. <laughs> this, is, this is the stuff that Team Fortress 2 would love to have. At least I believe it. Right. I don't think they have an explosive hat anyway. Will I need to wear my fedora again? No, you don't, won't, because this the mine is completely useless. Unless you're doing it for like silly, silly purposes, but otherwise it's pointless. But basically, the mine is it is a small, it has a surprisingly small hitbox, and that looks like a cap farting. Yeah, it's not even a satis it's not even like an explosion at a satisfactory. You can and also as Spencer said, you have to back up to a safe distance. The safe distance isn't that big, but you can get hit by it. Like, you don't need to be, like, a mile away from the mine for it to work. Basically. But. Yeah, see? And, like, you get hit by the fart. But it's like, As yeah. we all know, farts are very dangerous to raccoons. Yeah. This they, is, which uh, is why, Zoology 101, people. Which is why the raccoon... Which is why the, um... Oh, what's it called? What's it animal called that's, like, stinky and whatnot? Uh, skunk. Yeah, the skunks. The skunks are the, uh... The worst animal is the uh, nemesis of all raccoons. And you think I would be joking, but. well. Yes, so that is very smart. Keep the, a lock right next to the key that opens it. <laughs> Truly a criminal mastermind. Well, well it's mugshots. He's a gangster, and he's a gangster, muscular, and therefore not very smart. Oh right, obviously. Strong people aren't smart. I forget my comic book elementary, sorry. Yeah, so for once you can actually like get away with this for once. Well this mugshot certainly isn't shy. Okay, so we know he's here somewhere, but how are we supposed to find him? Mesa City is a big place! Given that he's a bulldog, it seems only reasonable to assume that he chose to live in a giant fire hydrant. That's some sound logic, Sly. Now you just need to find a way to break into the building's base. Oh, I'm sure I'll think of something. Yeah, as you can see, th that cutscene was had, it is impossible for Sly to be that high. He said he was actually uh, in I, the I air. noticed only when we looked down and we saw the dude uh, at the other end of the bridge. Yeah. Next time, we let someone else take over for a while. See you then. See you guys.